transform your judge into your genie. Have you ever caught your judge running your show? I did just the other day for the umpteenth time. I became aware of how much my judge was comparing me to everyone and everything. It was pointing out all the accomplishments and successes of others and smearing them in my face. The judge had a great case with so much evidence that all I wanted to do was crawl into a hole and hide. On this particular day, I felt like the world was coming to an end. I felt so small. It was a dark, black place that I was in, and it seemed infinite and never-ending. When I find myself consumed by the judge, it's as if I can't move. I'm paralyzed. I'm almost comatose. So I started to explore the judge, its color and its message, realizing that it really wants to keep me safe and protect me from saying the wrong thing or making a fool out of myself or being embarrassed or ashamed. I started to thank the judge for all it has done for me because it's really done a good job at keeping me small and safe. And then I started to feel a little bit more playful, and I invited my judge into my closet to play dress-up and choose some really fun clothes. And before I knew it, guess what the judge tro chose? Some really bright, turquoise, sparkly, cool genie pants. Right then and there, the judge transformed into the most beautiful genie and took out her beautiful magical bottle. And this is what she told me. Whenever the judge starts to act up again and it's making you feel small and useless, call upon the genie and let her out of the bottle to speak the truth. So I invite you all to do the same. When your judge is commanding you, dictating you, look at what the content is of the judgments and pass it on to your genie who can transform it into your magical dream reality. Whatever it is that's making you feel small or weakening you can become your fuel to propel you forward towards manifestation.